Welcome to this Excel quickie where I'm going to show you how to delete empty rows from your data sets in Excel. And I will show you a way to delete an entirely empty row or just based off a specific column. So here's our data set, pretty simple data set. And if you want to delete rows, you can select the entire data set. This will select empty rows from within your selection or you could select part of the data set, doesn't really matter, or you could select the entire worksheet and it's going to select the empties within only the data set. Then go to the Home tab, go to Find and Select, and go to Special. This is an awesome window. There's so much to do here. Definitely check it out. And what we want to do is go to Blanks. So we click Blanks, hit OK, and it has selected every blank cell in our data set. Now I'll show you in a moment that it doesn't just select the empty rows, but every blank. Go to any one of the blanks, right click, go to delete. We have a little delete window and you can choose if you want to delete only the cells or if you want to delete the entire row or the entire column. For this example, we're going to do entire row, hit OK, and it has deleted the empty rows. So we just have one, two, three, four. How awesome is that? So it's so easy. Select your data set, go to the Home tab, find and select, go to Special Blanks, and hit OK. I'm sure there's a great keyboard shortcut for Go to Special, but I just don't use it enough to remember it like I do Paste Special. So let's hit Control Z to undo that. And I'm going to show you one little potential issue here. Let's delete this so I have an empty cell there. I'm going to select the worksheet, go to Special, okie dokie. Where are you blanks? OK. Now let's say we had a big data set. It wasn't all on the screen at the same time. And I didn't notice this pesky little empty cell. So I right clicked it. Notice we have ASC-3 right there. So I right click it, hit Delete. Do entire row, hit OK. ASC-3 is now gone. So it doesn't delete only the empty rows when we have it like this. So you have to be very careful about that. However, usually if you have a data set like this, there's one important column. Could be, for instance, a unique identifier. In this case, a part number. So what you want to do there is just select the column off of which you would like to base selecting quote unquote empty rows. So let's say if it doesn't have a part number, then I want to kill it, remove it from my data set. That's what's important. If that's missing, then it shouldn't be there. So select that column, then find and select, go to special blanks and OK. Now it has only selected the blanks within our selection within this column. So we can right click, delete, entire row, OK, and ASC-3 is still there. Now there are other ways to do this, including using filters, but I find using the go to special blanks method to be very easy and very quick, and it works pretty well. So that's it for this quickie.